Hello, brethren. I hope all is well with all of you. Uh, today is November the 8th, so just a quick little side note. I hope all of you went out to vote uh, and continue to pray. Pray without ceasing. Um, this message is about being more concerned about pleasing God. This is a rhema word that uh, the Lord spoke to my heart on September 17th, and just looking through some of my journal writings, I had forgot to release it. So I'll just read it from my notes. This message, again, are for those of you who are walking out your God-given assignment, doing what God has commissioned you to do. God wants you to be at peace, be at peace, and come to peace with the fact that it is not necessary for others to recognize, applaud, or even support you. God is your support. He accepts you. He sees you. He will remember your obedience to him. And obedience in God's kingdom is rewarded. Um, so be a God pleaser, not a man pleaser. Um, that's pretty much it. I think it just comes from... Um, this word in particular, I have been thinking on, I often think on how much power we give to other people uh, and how by looking for them to, um, or assuming, I'll say it this way, assuming they don't support you. You know, you're not called, whatever you're doing, no one person is called to everyone. And many times, you what you deem as support isn't support and vice versa what you think someone's not supporting you god is supporting you and whatever seed he has given you to sow you sow that knowing that you have done your part so i often say whatever that is i say it to myself too drop your seed and keep going sometimes you're watering a seed that's already there in someone's life but again um I can often be heard saying, it's not my business what God does with uh, where I'm going, where he's taking me, what he wants me to do. It's my business to obey him. And that same thing goes for you. So be encouraged with that. Kind of keep that at the forefront of your mind because it truly will help you uh, from becoming bitter or becoming presumptuous. Um, because you can't say what somebody's supposed to be doing for you or how they are supporting. Many people support you without your knowledge. They may be um, praying for you, which is crucial. Um, they may be busy doing their own assignments, uh, and especially when we're on the same team. So um, that was just my little added piece there. But just want to remind you, remember your audience of one, which is the most important, and that is God. You want to hear him say, well done. And so with that, be blessed. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord be gracious to you. May the Lord lift his countenance upon you and give you his peace.